House Shark, 2017, directed by Ron Bonk, starring Trey Harrison, Michael Merchant, and Wes Reed. An ex-cop makes a horrific discovery. His house has been infested by a shark that lives on land. Can he and some obnoxious characters stop this implausible menace? One of the things that I love about the 2010s is that any ridiculous premise can be made into a film by independent filmmakers. Unfortunately, that also means that any ridiculous premise can be made into a film by independent filmmakers. There's nudity not even six minutes into this film. I don't think I've ever seen a babysitter strip completely naked to use the bathroom before, but here we are. The film aimed to be raunchy and over the top, but it only comes across as juvenile and amateurish. There's a lot of random jokey characters that come across as the byproduct of sketch comedy, silly voices and costumes included. Not included? Jokes that land. The plot attempts to spoof Jaws at times, but it doesn't do anything clever with it in the process. There's a handful of random Star Wars jokes thrown in as well, for no reason. There's a lot of butt jokes too, because... butts. This film has absolutely no business being over two hours long. There's over 20 minutes of gags that easily could have been cut. The house shark itself does look pretty great when it's on screen. I definitely appreciate that they made a physical costume instead of using digital effects. This film also executes a pretty funny underwater sequence towards the end, where the actors clearly aren't actually underwater. The film ends up being mildly funnier when dialogue is missing. Verdict, thumbs down. I'm afraid this catch should have been thrown back. That concludes this week's review. If there's any obscure sci-fi or horror film you'd like to suggest, feel free to leave a comment below. Make sure to tune in next time for another thrilling, low-budget adventure.